Hello my dear friends, welcome to my channel, Love to Entertain. Now please subscribe to my channel, Love to Entertain and click the bell icon just beside to get notifications of new videos being uploaded. Today we are going to make a pouch, a crochet pouch with a lemon peel stitch. I have made this to keep my hard disk and my other accessories in it. Now this is the front face of my lemon peel stitch uh, pouch. I will be using acrylic yarn and I have used three colors in it. You can use only one colored yarn. It's completely your choice. First, take the yarn and make a slip knot and then insert a 3 mm hook in it. Now, chain even number of stitches. So I have done 30 chains plus one additional chain. We will need even number of stitches always. Now we will begin the second row. In the second stitch from the hook we will do a double crochet. Then in the next stitch we will be doing a single crochet. Then again in the next stitch a double crochet followed by a single crochet in the following stitch. In this way we will repeat the sequence of single crochet, double crochet, sorry double crochet, single crochet throughout till we reach the end of the row. When you have reached the end of the first row, you will be doing a chain 1 and then turn your work. In the very first stitch of the next row, we will be doing a double crochet. Followed by single crochet in the next stitch. Then in the next stitch a double crochet. And in this way alternating double and single crochet throughout the row. Now in this row the double crochets are placed in the single crochet stitches of the previous row. And the single crochets are placed in the double crochet stitches from the previous row. So, an alternating uh, type of uh, stitches is followed here. Again at the end, we will do chain 1 and turn our work and begin with a double crochet in the next uh, row in a similar way. Followed by single crochet, double crochet, single crochet and so on. Okay guys, now... Since I will, I will be doing a color change, so I will be proceeding with the tutorial. But if you want, you can uh, just use one single color for the bag. So I have reached the end of the row and I have not done the chain 1. Now we will be introducing the white colored yarn. Firstly, we will do a slip knot with the white colored yarn. Now we will insert the uh, hook into the white colored yarn and pull the slip knot through the green colored knot in this way. Then do a chain 1 with the white colored yarn and tighten the green colored knot by pulling the green colored yarn. Now we will begin 
the next row with the white colored yarn similarly with a double crochet followed by a single crochet as earlier Now again, I'll be showing you how to do the color change. So take the green colored yarn and make a slip knot with it. Now insert the hook into the blue colored slip knot and pull the slip knot through the white colored loop. Now pull the white colored loop to tighten it, white colored uh, yarn to tighten it. Then do a chain with the blue colored yarn. Okay, and as earlier, start with a double crochet in the first stitch, followed by single crochets, and do this in alternate manner as earlier. So this stitch gives a very gives a slightly different pattern, which is quite pretty. At the end, we will just do a chain one and then cut the yarn. Now we will be doing the white colored border of single crochet. So first, do a slip knot and insert the hook in it. Then, in the corner, firstly do a slip stitch followed by chain one. To secure the stitch, and then in the same stitch at the corner, do a single crochet. In each of the stitches, do one single crochet each, but at the corners, you will be doing two single crochets. In the corner, do two single crochets. Now we have completed doing the white colored border. It is looking quite smart and pretty. If you want, you can make a purse out of it. So now I'll be adding the zipper to my pouch. Now you can see I have done stitches along the zipper and we will be doing single crochets through this these pink colored stitches. First, do a slip knot with a white colored yarn and insert the hook in it. Now we will be start joining the two faces of the pouch. Now we will begin just two or three stitches below the corner stitch and start doing single crochets as shown. So first we will secure it by doing a slip stitch and chain one and then in the same stitch we will do single crochet. Now do continue doing single crochet till you reach the corner.
Now take the zipper, insert the hook into the stitch of one of the face, then into the stitch of the zipper, then into the stitch of the second face. Then pull the yarn through the all the three stitches and do a single crochet. The first stitch will be a bit difficult but slowly it will become easier. Okay, so there you go. Your first single crochet with the zipper. Now move on to the next stitch of the face of the pouch and insert the hook into the same stitch of the zipper and in the next stitch of the second face and then pull the yarn through the three stitches and do a single crochet. Now we will begin doing single crochet with one face of the pouch with the uh, stitch of the zipper only and do it throughout the second stitch also through the same stitch of the zipper now it's up to you if the gap of your stitch of the zipper is, is large then you can do two single crochet through it if it's small you can do one single crochet through it my mine are large so i'm doing two single crochet to it through it in this way I am attaching the zipper to my pouch. Now I have reached the end of my zipper. Now I will be doing a single crochet through the corner stitch of the first face, through the last stitch of the zipper and through the corner stitch of the second space and then pull the yarn through it to do a single crochet. Then again a single crochet through the same stitch of the zipper to stiffen the stitch at that point. Now go on with doing single crochet with this face of the pouch and this side of the zipper stitches. Now when you have reached the end of your single crochets of the zipper, just slip stitch through the single crochets of the two faces till you reach the end of the single crochet. And then start doing single crochets 
between two faces. So now join the two faces together with single crochets throughout. Two single crochets along the corner. At the end, just do a slip stitch through the first single crochet and a chain 1 and then cut the yarn. If you want, you can add a strap to your pouch. It's very easy, just single crochets. When the pouch turned out quite cute, you can store your makeups also in it. Well, thank you guys for watching this video till the end. If you liked this video then hit the like button and comment in the comment section below and also share my videos and please subscribe to my channel. It's completely free to get updates of new videos. Thank you very much.